we come to a Canadian artist. Uh, her name is, I, I want to be careful about her last name, but I'm not sure if I'm going to be right. Uh, Karen Espig. Uh, Karen Espig is a Canadian artist. Uh, I have to say, Karen, I, uh, I, I did a lot of research on your work. I, I did a lot of uh, uh, viewing and, and I love all your, all your themes. Uh, I, I found your work very sensitive. Uh, it's, uh, uh, Karen Espig is, is an artist who is very, uh, from what I saw, very fascinated with the human body. Uh, you know, there's a, a touch of romanticism in there, a touch of uh, uh, eroticism, a touch of poetry. So I, I find your paintings like poems. So thank you so much for all the inspiration that you've given to me. Uh, here's Karen. I want you all to see Karen. And, um, uh, oh, actually, this is the word, but let me show you Karen first. Uh, here is Karen. Experience some uh, technical difficulties here with this one. Uh, either way, I'm going to show you Karen afterwards. Uh, but this is the work uh, that I uh, was really struck by uh, uh, by, by Karen's art. Uh, she called it the autumn sessions. Uh, I, I love autumn. Autumn is one of my favorite seasons because of the, uh, the colorful uh, nature of it. Um, obviously, it, it's a beautiful work because the details with which Karen worked this, uh, this uh, piece of art are amazing. The uh, the reflections, uh, the position, oh, here's Karen. <laughs> uh, the position in which uh, she captured the, the cellist uh, playing, and uh, it, it feels so natural. I mean, coming from the music world, I, 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 can, feel it, I can feel the music before uh, artists play it, and, and I could see that in, in that position that she caught it. It's, it's a very romantic and, and poetic position, uh, ready to, to play the beautiful uh, sound of cello. Here's Karen. And uh, I want to, yeah, focus it on her work. Autumn Sessions. Now, I'm, I'm going to play actually a, a work that I originally wrote for cello, but I'm going to play it here with the piano. Uh, it's a cello prelude. For a second, I got lost into a, 
my own sounds, I, I started believing that my left hand was a cello and my right hand was a violin and then uh, alternating between the violin and the piano. But uh, maybe this person is a real cellist and, and I will uh, once have the opportunity to play uh, the piece. So I'm going to have to ask Karen about this. But thank you very much, Karen. I, I appreciate all the inspiration and, uh, and uh, just like with the other artists, I, I would love to, uh, to play for you this piece in person.